hello everyone i'm rebecca welcome back to my channel i'm here to share another amazing recipe with you i'm making sweet bar or you can also call that sweet bun so in this chai i have some flour and i'm using two and a half cups of all purpose flour I'm adding half cup of sugar onto the flour. I'm also adding half of teaspoon of nutmeg. Two and a half teaspoon of baking powder whenever you are making your sweet bar try and add a uh, nutmeg to it it gives a really good flavor so I'm mixing all the dry ingredients together very well before adding the wet ingredients So in this bowl, I have two large eggs that I'm mixing. In this cup, I have one fourth of vegetable oil, one fourth cup of vegetable oil. I'm not using butter for this recipe because I have tried butter and I have tried the vegetable oil and I prefer the outcome of the vegetable oil with this recipe but you have the option to use butter as well in that bowl or in this bowl I have a uh, 3 4 cup of whole milk I'm just mixing all together and pour it onto the flour I will use this same fork to just mix it up well and the mixing process don't take too long it's very easy as you can see I'm all done mixing it up you want this kind of a consistency you don't want it to loose and again you don't want it to dry just as you see it in this bowl this is very easy very delicious and quick to get it done so whenever you want to eat some sweet bag get in the kitchen and give it a try so I have some oil on the stove that have been heating up I'm just going to use my ice cream scoop to scoop out some of the flour into the oil and another thing I would like to share with you all when you are frying sweet bar you want to make sure the stove is on low because the sweet bar take time to get cooked from the inside it get cooked from the outside pretty quick but that doesn't mean the inside is cooked when you remove it from the oil surprisingly the inside is still wet so when you are frying your sweet bar make sure that your stove is on medium heat and sweet bar you, you don't have to be in any special shape you know so yeah i'm just turning it around so the other side can get brown as you can see is brown but i will allow it to stay a little longer in the oil making sure that the inside is cooked as well 
so i will have the uh, the ingredients listed in the description area you can just check it out so whenever you want to make some for yourself so as you can see it's golden brown it looks beautiful it's ready i'm just transferring it onto the cooling wrap so it can get cool before having some to eat so yeah this remind me of <laughs> of uh liberia back then when we were much younger when we get five or ten librarian dollars from our mom or from our parents especially those that are love or sweet bar we would just run on the road and buy it usually the the sellers usually put it in a little bit of in a box or transparent box that looks so tempting but uh, i'm not sure if you can get this for five like brand dollars anymore the way things are pretty expensive now in our country so guys this is the end result of the sweet buy it's not only looking beautiful but i'm telling you it tastes really good i'll just take one you know i will just grab one of it and open it into half and show you what i'm talking about it's very soft from the inside and crispy on the outside look how beautiful it is so again i will end up by telling you all thank you for every time you spend on this channel again please support this family by subscribing and by liking this video and hitting the notification button thanks again bye guys